Welcome to Dashcam Builders. In this video, I will share with you how to fix your hosting emails going to spam. The first step to ensure that your hosting emails land on the inbox is to set up your SPF, DKIM, and DMRAC records correctly. How to do this? It's simple. Just log in to your uh, hosting account where your domain is. Then go to emails, click next to your domain name, click on mailboxes. Then you will see your Hostinger email address here. Now, instead of doing anything, go to connect domain. If you see some records are not set up well, for example, as you see here, next to receive emails to your mailbox, this is or the mx records are well set up but for protecting my email reputation or increasing email deliverability i have issues how to fix this it's simple just go to your domain uh, domain settings in my case just to clarify why i jump between those two accounts my hosting email is on this first account but my domain is registered on a different hosting account. For you, it's the same thing. If you're, uh, if in your, if you, in your case, your domain and email accounts are both on the same account, it's the same thing. Now go to domains, and next to your domain name, click on manage. Then go to DNS slash name servers, and scroll down to manage DNS records and start adding the expected records here here let me let's check the status again as you see i have no records by the way i already know even though i ha i have the connected status here the i still need to put my uh, my dns records uh, uh, responsible of protecting my reputation which are which i can get from here don't worry in your case you uh, i think most of the time you will see no records three times here here and here now let's start adding uh, dns records responsible of re of receiving emails the first uh, the dns record type is mx select it from this list mx the name is at already uh, written the value is this here i recommend you to copy this value using this copying icon instead of copying it manually to avoid any error now the priority is five all right five and for the ttl is this long number it's the same one click on add record and as you see dns record created successfully now let's keep repeating the same thing for the other records mx name at value this the priority is 10 and the ttl is okay now as you see for receiving emails let's here after clicking on check status i should see a green uh, connected here instead of no records here uh, with dns updates even you you still see no records after updating correctly your dns here don't worry updating your dns records takes time to fully uh, connect so if if you are sure as you see after uh, some seconds the status turned to connected now let's move to uh, the dns records uh, responsible of protecting my email reputation it's a simple txt record type look for txt name at and this is the value for the ttl is 360 double zero click on add record now let's keep repeating the same thing for all of those records 
so i will copy this c name c name this is the name the value is this and the ttl is 300 i type it manually add it successfully the second c name value is this the target 300 add record now let's do let's repeat the same thing c name value or name value 300 click on add a record now let's jump to the message authentication the type is txt txt this is the name and this is the value and for the ttl is 360 double zero click on add record now uh, that i've added all the dns records let's check the status again as you see now the email reputation is detected and keep checking the status till you see connected next to all of those records to verify if your uh, dns is uh, added successfully just copy a value for example and search for it as you see it is already uh, added so this this guarantees that it is added but it still uh, requires some time to fully take effect now uh, instead of keep updating or refreshing this page let's move to the next uh, reason to fix your hostinger email uh, spam issue which is monitoring your domain spam rate on Google. So I will open this link here, which is Postmaster. Let's zoom on it here. This is the link you should visit, postmaster.google.com. You will land on this page. Click on this uh, plus icon, fill in your domain, domain name here, bensutorial.com. Click on next it has been added to your add another let's here they uh, they, sca they skipped a verification step for me because this domain was already added here now to show you this verification step i will try to add another domain ben tutorial to tutorial to dot com which is not registered now this is the verification step they skipped here they ask you to add this txt record to the dns configuration of your domain just copy this text same thing go to the dns management area and select txt here and for the name keep it at and here the value past it like that and hit add a record now when you click on verify they will say that we have successfully verified your domain and you will see it verified like this first one here after verifying your domain like that click on it and you will see your spam rate here for this since this is a uh, they they still have no data about my the, my uh, domain name here you should check this uh, spam rate page from time to time in order to monitor if your spam rate is down or up and uh, think of what is responsible of your uh, spam rate change let's say for example you started an, a newsletter and your spam rate goes up this means that your uh, newsletter is affected your spam rate Before we continue, I want to let you know that you can get access to my Hostinger web hosting online course today for free. Inside this course, you will learn many things including how to get started with Hostinger, how to set up your WordPress website and configure it, how to customize your WordPress website, SSL, security, privacy, email setup, launch and index your website, speed and performance optimization, how to use Lightspeed Cache Plugin, and also how to manage your files, databases, and backups. 
to get all of this today for free plus my other online courses like Hostinger Website Builder or Hostinger License, just join Dutchcom Builders Academy from this link academy.dutchcom.builders link in the description. Without any further ado, let's continue this video. The next thing that you should do in order to fix your Hostinger email spam issue is just simply contacting and your click contacting and unspamming yourself here all you need to do is to connect to your uh, hosting your email box click on compose uh, contact yourself on the other <coughs> email uh, email addresses you have for example for example simply click on uh, for example uh, normal subject normal short subject line for example hi ben how are you today now click on send from hostinger then then open this email message on your gmail for example and reply for example with i'm, uh, I'm better like this to have a reply and don't forget to uh, make this important or if it lands on the spam make it not, not from here i think click on this uh, star icon filter message let's use filter messages like this create a filter never send it to spam this is what i'm looking for always mark it, mark it as important and create a filter now this action will be automatic for you if this message lands on spam like this open it like that and click on re report not spam this way you let gmail knows that your hostinger email address is safe repeat this with multiple uh, email addresses you have on gmail and this a little bit improves your uh, spam rate the next thing is searching converse conversations by contacting others and reply to received messages here let's say for example i received a message for example from uh, this message reply to it start replying to it and uh, uh, here what i'm uh, but don't avoid persons that are you, you are avoid the uh, replying to someone that you are sure will not reply to you so here the other person reply you continue the conversation this way you uh, report or your spam rate goes down or improves now let's check the second practice these now we have best, best practices to keep your emails out of the spam folder the first one is is to avoid spammy words like uh, free money act now free free something or in any avoid using spammy words the second best, best practice is always use plain text version instead of uh, designed uh, emails with plain text version or what is a plain text version or email a plain text uh, email is something that you write like this hi ben for example are you up are you are you down to travel for example this is a plain text when you insert logos and HTML, uh, HTML logos, this makes your uh, message looks spammy and land on the spam folder. So always use plain text. Next, send from a consistent email and, and address. Here, this uh, best practice simply means that don't uh, use multiple addresses, focus on improving the spam rate of, the, of a single hosting account at a, at a time the second thing the second best practice is warming up your new email i think this means starting conversations with others and with yourself 
next you you can keep your email list clean here if you use your hosting your email address for example on an email list uh, for example on uh, brevo or mailchimp or get response keep your email list clean to avoid uh, by removing inactive or bounced addresses this improves your or cleans your email list and also improves your uh, spam rate also add a reply to and unsubscribe link this is important to show some uh, trust or to get trust from uh, gmail and other email provider and the last best practice is monitor keep monitoring your domain reputation for example on uh, postmaster this link and other services like uh, mail tester and mx toolbox to see if there is uh, any issues with your dns or email your domain dns for email and that was all for how to fix hosting your emails going to spam if you still have a question leave it in the comments below and don't forget to give this video a like thank you